What's up YouTube, Timothy Benny here, professional photographer and filmmaker. Today we're going to do a real world review on the AK2000S gimbal. It's coming up right now. couple things I love about this gimbal. One, it does house the Canon 5D Mark IV, which I was curious about before I purchased it. I wasn't really able to find any videos that had this camera mounted. So if you're thinking about getting it for this uh, 5D Mark IV, it does fit. It's really tight here, but it definitely uh, works for it. You can mount um, an 85 millimeter, which is on what's on here right now, 50 millimeter prime. And I also was able to mount my 28 millimeter I could not put the 2470 on um, and get it balanced correctly. It's too uh, forward heavy. But uh, absolutely love this gimbal. Shot a wedding with it just this last weekend. Um, I will have that video. But stay around to the end. I'm gonna actually show you guys that wedding I shot. One of the things I absolutely loved about using this gimbal uh, during this wedding I shot was I didn't have to rebalance. As long as I was using a lens around the same weight. They weren't exactly the same, uh, but my 28, prime, my 85 prime and my 50 prime, I was able to swap out all throughout the day and I didn't have to rebalance. And if I did take the camera off the gimbal to, to swap out batteries, it's got a little notch in the back, a little white notch. And as long as you line it up back on the plate to that notch, you don't have to rebalance at all. Just turn it back on, you're ready to go. Another thing I love about this gimbal is you can probably see it's got this little back handle right here. Absolutely takes a lot of the weight um, off of your other arm, especially if you're getting down for shots that are low or up high, the handle just really nice. Um, I just kept that on at all times. Um, battery life on this is about seven hours. I shot for about six hours straight, um, and then I shot a little bit the next day when I got home. The battery's drained right about seven hours. Um, there is a little hack that I'll show you guys um, where I actually I'm able to, if you run out of battery, because the batteries aren't removable on this, you have to charge it, it runs out, you got to stop and charge. So I do have a little portable power bank for my cell phone, and if you actually uh, have some gaff tape or something, you can tape it onto the uh, handle right here underneath and plug it in and it'll actually give you, I haven't tested this yet, but I'm assuming probably another hour or so um, of battery life. Hi right, guys, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but this is my little cell phone power bank. I just have it plugged into the cable that came with the AK2000S. So if you plug it in here, it'll begin to charge. So if you're in a pinch at a wedding or at an event, you need another hour or so out of it. Just literally plug this thing in, uh, make sure you bring some gaff tape or something. You can literally just tape this right here under the belly of this arm and you still have full motion and you can just keep on filming. All right, pros and cons of this gimbal. Pros, I'm gonna say ease of use. Uh, the fact that it can mount bigger cameras, not just uh, mirrorless. 5D Mark IV mounts no problem on it. Um, love the ergonomics, super comfortable, super easy to use. Um, it's got all the modes, uh, follow mode, pan mode. Um, it can do the barrel rolls, pretty much you know, everything that all the other gimbals can do. Um, cons, I would say, is the battery. I do wish it had removable batteries. So if you did run out in an event, you could just pop them some new batteries in without having to either you know, do something like this or stop and recharge. Um, and I do wish I could mount my 2470 on here, but that would probably just take a bigger payload gimbal, um, like maybe something like the AK4000. But overall, this is an amazing gimbal. I highly recommend it. And uh, if you guys want to see that uh, wedding video, it's going to start right now. Father, we just come to you today and we just ask you to bless uh, Shiloh and Carrie, uh, bless their marriage, bless their lives moving forward together. And uh, we're, we're just so thankful um, to have this opportunity to, uh, to, to share this with them and, and for them to have this opportunity to uh, come together in this way with their family and their friends as witnesses and most importantly, God, with, with you as the witness. And uh, we, just, we just know that you're going to bless them and that you're going to you're gonna um, uh, bring them beautiful things and 
and uh, just go, go in front of them in life. And uh, we just are really, really grateful for that. We pray all these things in Jesus' precious name. Amen. How are you? Who, who gives the bride to be wed? Me and my sister. <laughs> 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 and then... How was it to be wedded? Um... <laughs> <laughs> I'm a lucky man. <laughs> <laughs> Three strands is not easily broken. Shiloh and Carrie? Please come and see me today. I love your dress. Oh, thank you. I like it. Beautiful. Mm. Friends and family, the three cords that they're braiding represent God, Shiloh, and Terry. As stated in the scripture, these three things woven throughout their marriage creates an unbreakable bond together. For richer or poorer, keeping yourself unto her as long as you both shall live. I do. <laughs> Terry, take Shiloh to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold, in sickness and in health, in good times and bad, for richer or poorer, keeping yourself unto him as long as you both shall live. Thank you. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's the ring. Ha! It's not too late. <laughs> <laughs> this ring, an unbroken circle, represents unending love. When either of you look upon these rings, may you be reminded of this moment, of the love and of the commitment that you promised to one another. Shiloh, take the ring. Place the ring on Carrie's finger and repeat after me. Carrie. Carrie? I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my unending love. As a symbol of my unending love. A symbol that I want to share my life's journeys with you. A symbol that I want to share my life journeys with you. I give you this ring with the pledge. I give you this ring with the pledge. To love you today. 
to love you today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol. Huh. As a symbol. Of my unending love. No, no, no. A symbol that I want to share. A symbol I want to share. My life journeys with you. My life journeys with you. Mm. I, I give you this <laughs> ring. I give you this ring. With the pledge. With the pledge and pleasure. To love you. To love you. Today. Mm. Today. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Always. Always. And forever. Forever. <laughs> Shiloh and Carrie, I wish you both much love. I wish that for many years you will come to experience many good times and very few bad times. I wish that every day your love would be strong and as fresh as it is today. I wish that you would always look for the best in one another and that when life challenges come along, as we know they will, <laughs> Shiloh and Carrie, <laughs> you have pledged your faith to each other in the company of two wonderful families, a circle of friends. Therefore, by the power vested in me, by the state of California, I now pronounce you husband and wife. May <laughs> kiss your bride. Love you. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm about to present for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Yeah. <laughs> I 
just wanna love you, I just wanna hold you Just wanna be with you till we grow old Just tell me you'll stay or take me away I want you for myself every single day You set my world on fire You set my world on fire I didn't think we were meant to be together. I'm not kidding. But they have. And they are like two officers that just mingle into each other and they're beautiful. They're the two most beautiful people I've ever met. So, whoa, bring your glasses up and woo! So then I met Daisy. And I thank the Lords. <laughs> because then I could love Charlotte. I'm so happy to be uh, the best man. Um, so a little bit of history, uh, I started uh, hanging out with, with uh, Shiloh about five years ago and uh, we went on a ride together, um, ended up hanging out down at Ventura, what a crazy time. I, this was the craziest guy I ever know, I've ever known in my life. Uh, yeah, and it's like, there's nobody as crazy as this dude and I loved it. I really did. He was a great guy. Oh, how much work it is for everybody to come out here and be here, and I really appreciate everybody, and I love you so much. Thank you for being here. <laughs> All right guys, that does it for this one. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. And let me know if you have any questions on the gimbal, if you already own this gimbal. Tell me how you like it and how it's working in, for your workflow. Um, also, let me know how you guys like the wedding film. I appreciate any feedback you guys have to give. And uh, as always, always pursue your passions, keep crushing it. See you at the next one.